So I've had some questions on what these black peppers were. When we did a video on Gary's dishwashers that he turns into planters, and he, and he took one of the bell peppers that I had bought. So last year I purchased a tray, six plants, and they call them purple bells. They look black, but I guess it's a very deep purple. Let's see if we can get underneath. Look at all of them growing back there. Now here is the thing with them. They're not ripe. See here one, here's a young one right here. It's green, and I'm gonna call it black. It's green and black. That's how they grow. And then they get bigger and bigger. They're almost the size of a regular bell pepper you would buy in the store, like a green bell, which is truly a red bell, but we won't go into that right now. And they'll keep growing. Now, when they're black like this, they're not ripe. This is still in their growing stage. Very similar to eggplant. Eggplant, you pick them when they're purple and they're not ripe. Well, with these, if you want them to be ripened, he's got one on the plant that's just starting to ripen. And see, it's turning red. They will turn a very bright red. They'll lose that black, purple coloring and turn bright red. They're not hot, which is quite nice. Very similar to a sweet red bell pepper when they're red. And let me tell you, you can use them when they're black. I've made potato salad in different dishes and, you know, they're very showy in potato salad when you've got them chopped up in that dark purple black color. So just like a regular green bell pepper, you can use them when they're black like this or purple. Think of them like a green bell pepper. They're not ripe, but they're still good. Or you can leave them on the plant and you can use them when they turn red. So either way, very versatile. You can use them either way. You can pick them when they're black. They'll taste very similar to a green bell pepper or use them when they're red. I've got a few that have dried up over winter on here. We're now in the spring, but the plant itself did very, very well. And it's got new flowers. So we should have a lot of them coming up. I've got a few of mine that survived in my garden and they're wimpy compared to this, but they should come back. And if they don't, we have a lot of seeds now that we've collected, at least enough to probably get ourselves started again. And if not, you know, I bought this at, I can't even remember, one of the nurseries I went to, and I had never seen it before, and I really thought it was interesting, so I bought them, and they grew pretty good over uh, summer and in the fall. But for him, in the dishwasher, they must have stayed warm, the metal stays warm. So it warmed up during the day, because bell peppers like it warm during the day, and they like cooler nights, certain bells. So it must have been just the perfect condition for them in the dishwasher. And so that's why this particular one survived really, really well. He only took, I believe, one from me. He asked if he can throw one in here. He had his um, ubes growing in here. So I said, sure, take, take all you want. So he took one, and I planted the rest, I think, in my garden. I'm not sure he may have one in his garden down below, but we know this one because people saw it in the video and they asked. So it's called Purple Bell. It actually said Bell Purple. I'll have to double check. I'll show you the label, if it's still on the original plant up in my garden. And to me, they look black, but they're calling them purple, and I think it's really neat. So again, you know, you can eat them at any stage. And they look quite nice. If you're making a salad or something, or you slice them up and put them on a plate, you got people over, they're going to say, what the heck is that? And you tell them, it's a bell pepper. So let's go see the one in my garden. I've got a red one, I believe, up there. And see what else I can show you from those. So here's my little pepper plant that's still kind of hung on for the winter, even through the freeze. And this is the same pepper plant that is down in Gary's dishwasher. Let me see if I can reach in there and show you the label. And there it is. It's called a Pepper Bell Purple. Isn't that interesting? Pick that up and it wintered okay, so we'll see. This one I've trimmed back. There's a bad one back here, but what I'm gonna do is pick that and take the seeds out 
and dump them somewhere and let them grow. But that's what they look like when they're ripe. And they are really something. So have a great day. And don't forget to eat what you grow. And please like and subscribe. Thanks all. Bye-bye.